we're bringing some set photos from Matt Reeves' Batman today. First picture there, you can see a van, Gotham Water and Power. Um, and then we're going to the police cars, and there's also a taxi there. And they're both Queen Victorias, which are quite old vehicles. Um, we've also got uh, Mr. Bruce Wayne, Robert Pattinson, sitting on a motorbike there. I'm not sure on the year, make and model of that motorbike. Maybe someone in the comments can let us know. However, the one thing I am noticing is a big fat HD sign on the side of Gotham Action News, which suggests to me... Um, that it's not in the 90s because HD wasn't around then unless we're in an alternate universe where we've got HD already but I just think I don't know I can't see that happening what was the point you know if, if HD wasn't about then there's no need to add it in just for the sake of a cleaner picture there's not too much to take away from these photos just that you know essentially we can see that the you know they are world building Gotham at the moment um, a quick picture of Robert Pattinson on his motorbike I potentially on his journey to become Batman um, start his training or he's finished his training I'm really interested to see the other photos that potentially going to come out over the next couple of weeks uh, hopefully more set photos fingers crossed for a picture of the bat suit maybe it's too early doors yet I don't know hoping for blue and grey uh, like a lot of people I know me and Nathan have discussed this before and I think a blue and grey will look pretty good on screen it, it's definitely stand out another way to make Batman look different and he's still instantly recognizable especially from uh, the animated series which I'm really hoping and that that's the way they're going to go with the the look and vibe of Gotham City only time will tell when we get more set of photos and maybe who knows even a trailer at some point still seeing comments about Robert Pattinson's height and his weight um I think there was a report a few weeks ago about him struggling to put weight on. I'm sorry, but I'm not buying into it all. At the end of the day, Tom Cruise is five foot six, and it's never ever been an issue in any of his films where I've gone, Jesus fucking hell, he's short. Forced perspective is a thing in Hollywood, if it really comes down to it, but I don't think it's going to be that much of an issue. I think people are just getting a bit upset over nothing, really. <laughs> Thanks for watching the video guys, if you want to see more hit the subscribe button, hit the like button because it does help our channel out and make sure you go and check out the other videos that Nathan and Luke have been uploading as well. Peace!